Last one, and uh, uh, every one of these is, is, uh, is, is, is greater than every other one. So all three of them are greater than each other, uh, which means they're all great. Uh, <laughs> but this one really hits close to home for me because I live in Washington, D.C., uh, quite famously. And um, uh, what a lot of people don't know is that Washington, D.C., though it's our nation's capital, and it has some of the most beautiful buildings and some of the most brilliant people anywhere in the world. Uh, there's also a lot of pain in D.C. And one of the sources of that pain is the fact that in D.C. we have the highest rate of HIV and AIDS anywhere in the country. Between one, no, one out of every 100 young people in D.C. One out of every 100, you go to a party, one out of every 100 young people in D.C. between the ages of 13 and 24 have HIV. Now, this is at a level consistent with a sub-Saharan African nation where we know the, the epidemic is, is, is most vicious. There is a young man who I want to bring to the stage who is an athlete. He's a scholar. In fact, he's a Rhodes Scholar. Um, and he, w he decided to use his, uh, skill, uh, his talent and his skill as an athlete uh, a couple years ago to go to South Africa. And he was fighting HIV over in South Africa. And what he realized was that he could also take those same tools and bring them home and use them at home. So I want to bring Tyler Spencer out here. Get out here, Tyler Spencer. Now, this is an extraordinary story because this is a world-class athlete, soccer player, uh, who knows that that's one way to get young people's attention and to have a conversation about tough issues, to talk about it in the context of team and sports and health. And he's getting through to people that other people cannot get through to. And so he uh, has this uh, grassroots project, uh, which he's going to expand and also evaluate. Uh, he is working with George Washington University. He's working with MTV. He's working with Nike. He's working with the DC Department of, of uh, Health and Public Schools. He's working with the Boys and Girls Club. Uh, he's got everybody on his team. And I think we should be on his team too. Give him a round of applause for the work he wants to do.